That's right, Darla and Dal for talking about the history of this festival. It was just nine years ago when this event made its debut in downtown Jennings right here at Founders Park. And I talked to park goers. I talked to people who have been attending this event every year and even the coordinators. They tell me every year, although it's a different vibe, the crowds, they grow larger and larger each year. It's just a great way to pass a Tuesday and for free. How often do you get that? Since 2015, bands, local food vendors, and locals have gathered at Founders Park in downtown Jennings for Turn It Up Tuesdays. Just local bands coming out and playing music uh, every Tuesday, and it's grown from there. Tisha O'Neillian, the executive director of Jeff Davis Arts Council, says every year the event brings a special spark to the downtown area, drawing record-breaking crowds. Definitely through the years, we've watched it grow and grow and grow. Uh, we started pretty small, and then uh, a couple years later, it kind of blew up a little bit more. Um, and as we continue on, our bands get a little bigger and our crowds get larger. Turn It Up Tuesdays offers a great time for tourists and locals, while also guaranteeing consistent foot traffic in the downtown area really allows for people to come and explore the downtown area of Jennings. People come out as early sometimes as 9 o'clock in the morning and start setting up chairs um, because they want to get that good spot right where they can see the band. Uh, and typically what happens is they'll meander around the town after that. And I can definitely agree with what Tisha just said. As you can see behind me, the lawn is being filled with chairs. People are getting ready. We're right in the middle of sound check right now. But as she mentioned, people are creating spots, comfortable spots for them and their family to just hang out. But coming up at six, speaking of that foot traffic, I'll talk to a local museum tour guide who talks about how this foot traffic impacts the museum in the area. Live in Jennings, Daniel Duncan, KLFY News 10.